So yes combatants, it seems that we are going to be getting Jay, Cyrax, so much more coming in this thing. So do like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, and see you boy future boy, follow me to the future for more content. So yes people, it seems that after so long we are finally going to be getting Noob Cyber, Cyrax, so much more. So as this day to mind right here, first says Jade versus, and this is obviously intro as she goes for all reasons, you'll soon understand. That's so sad for you. The slaughter will, will stop Nitara and the Tarians are beneath contempt. So right there you can see that Jade is officially going to be in this game. So yes, all you Jade stands, you were heard. Jade is coming. I mean, she is mentioned multiple times in the um, in people's intro dialogues and also in the story. She's mentioned as one of the Titans that she could be. So literally right there, that opens the door for Jade to be in this Mortal Kombat game. And at least now you guys know officially that Jade is coming. How are you feeling? Are you excited? Are you happy? But then now we're gonna move over to Cyrax. So this Johnny Cage run where he goes, let me and I'll be the ketchup to your mustard. Now you guys already know from yesterday's video that the data minds have seen that both Cyrax and Sector cameo have both got rigs in them that show that they're going to be playable so it does come across there are multiple different phrases of things that are said in this game in the data mine that show that they are multiple robots so by multiple it must mean that there must be two because it's showing there are two different dialogues though it could be perceived as possibly um, it's just worded in a way that sounds like there's two but the one that seems to go right on track with everything is that there is one robot that's coming and that's Cyrax so that would mean that possibly Travis Scott really is playing human Cyrax and this is all for the story by the way as well so that means that Cyrax will be appearing in the story which means he could be the combat pack 3 which will be the story expansion or combat pack 2 might even be the story expansion we don't know but it definitely will have a Cyrax in there which is good I'm glad I really wanted these ninjas back I'm glad that they're coming back. But like I said, the rigging that's inside the cameo version shows that Sector has the same ones as Cyrax, which means that they are being made playable. So we can tell. Maybe we've just got the data mine for Cyrax because he comes beforehand. But then now we have this big list. So as you can see, after digging more with the intros, there's evidence of the following characters. Noob Cybot, Cyrax the Robot, Koti the Koatal, He-Man or Conan, Ghostface, an unknown girl, and Jade and then Kung Jin as well and Cassie Cage so right there we have those characters that are coming I know there's a lot of you are saying what Cassie Cage is coming and not Sonya Blade I know there's I don't know what's going on there but the fact that we could be possibly getting He-Man or Conan or Kowatal very interesting but the unknown girl do not know who that could be that could be Sonya for all we know or someone completely different but like I said, some of these could actually be cameos and not actually things. Even though it's saying intro dialogues, we never know. I, things could change around, but I definitely think Noob Cybot will make it on the list. He's been rumoured for far too long to be on the roster, so this just further confirms that. Same as Cyrax. Cyrax further confirms all the other intro dialogues, which I am glad. I'm glad Cyrax is returning. Heck, we can't get both ninjas, Cyborg ninjas, but at least... From what we have right now, we have Cyrax, which is even more better. But when it gets to obviously Cassie Cage now, I know what most people are saying. Why not Sonya Blade? I'm even thinking that. But you know, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why they chose to have her instead. But hopefully it's an error and she's a cameo instead of that. Now Kung Jin, once again, like I said about Cassie, I mean, I don't think his voices were loud enough to hear for wanting him back. But you know, his design does look pretty sick. So yeah, I saw that coming. But then obviously, Kowatao, we know he's been mentioned a couple times, he's mentioned in story mode, and he's also mentioned in intro dialogues to General Xiao from uh, Melina, or Kitana, I think that says he's being replaced, and same to Reiko, so obviously there's a, there's, a, there's a want for him, so I could see, and hopefully they're doing justice this time. Then also Skeletal, well, He-Man, I mean. I don't think that He-Man will be in this because obviously it doesn't feel right. I think he'd more fit in Injustice because there's so much more blood in this. I don't feel it going right for him. But when it comes to Conan, yes, I do see that. Conan has blood. It's brutal. It's definitely something that could work in it. And remember, Ed Boon said a while ago that there was another surprise guest face appearance that's supposed to be in this. And I don't think he's on about Travis Scott. 
I do feel that he's on about another type of actor person who's really big on the business and I feel like that could definitely be Conan and I feel like Conan would be the perfect one for it and it would work so well with Arnold returning to do a role that is one of his most famous roles that he loved and wanted to do more of. Now Ghostface, I know a lot of you guys were saying before that Ghostface is too slow or how can he work in this, he's too clumsy but remember Joker's also someone who's very giggly and everything like that he works in this he's similar to him in a way you just nrs can make him any way they want as long as he's true to the character he can do moves well let's just say he attacks you and then he trips and chucks the knife into your chest and then runs over and then quickly grabs the knife out and then kicks you away easily moves that he could pull off and do right there animations or whatnot that could be his grab or something but I'm glad Ghostface could be in this because I've been wanting him in MK for ages. He would just work and it would just fit so well. So hopefully these are ones. Now this isn't definite combat pack 2. This could possibly be combat pack 3. Some of them could be spread out throughout the combat pack. So I wouldn't be looking for them in combat pack 2 because we never know. That might still be Serena or whatnot, but we can't tell. But let me know. What do you think of all this? Are you happy with all of these? Are you glad Jade and Noob and people like Cyrax are back? And what about the other guest characters? Are you happy about them? But do like, subscribe, people. This is your boy, Future Boy. As always, stay frosty peeps. Peace.